All right, people, this is a short review of uh, the little radios I got. This in here, just received last month. Cute little radio. This in here I've had for a couple years. As you see, they're two different radios, basically the same. This is a Bufong UVR5A dual bander this in here is a UVR 53 tri bander all right as you can see one antenna is just a little bit longer than the other one anywho this in here four watts high UHF VHF one watt low UHF VHF this one, they claim it to be 5 watts on 2 meter, 4 watts U on UHF. Well, this radio, hmm, I don't know, they, they banned these radios in the United States right now. But I use this once in a while. It's just got nothing but ham frequencies in it. This in here I use all the time. It's got all the ham frequencies in it. That's it. This radio here, real good radio. But anyhow, just a little in view. Yeah. Not a bad little rig. I mean, it's a shame the government is putting a band on these radios. Cute little radio. This radio right here I really like. Channel mode. It's uh menu. Got all your modes. Exit. I program this with the chirp program. And I run uh this antenna on it. I don't know if it's going to focus or not. It's a dual band antenna. It's supposed to be a 2.0 dB gain antenna. A little better than the stock one here. But this is a good little rig. Just can't use it no more because the government put a stop to it. This in here I can still use because it's FF, FCC certification. So, Four, I kind of like it. Six, nine, one, one. It's small. Just wish they uh, wouldn't have banned the doggone things. Anywho, that's just a little bit of my ham equipment. I have more out in the shack, but I hardly ever get out there. But anyhow, if you guys are interested in one of these, kind of stay away from this one right here. I don't know if you can see it or not. The UVR3. Three, one, two, three. Kind of stay away from this rig. Not pleased with it. I thought it'd be better. <laughs> Boy, the joke was on me. But, alright guys. Little, of a few of my toys. 73.